Here's a small demo on how I work editing clips in original aspect ratio, but also taking into account uh, destination aspect ratio. So for that, I have the source here. I have two clips here as an example in UHD aspect ratio. And I have a sequence with two bars that represent the boundaries of the destination aspect ratio. While that's not essential, it, it is very helpful. So I just create two bars here and I put their uh, opacity about 50% so that uh, you can still see what's underneath. And I put these two bars in a sequence. And then if we look at the source, I include these bars. Um, so you can easily turn them on and turn them off so you can see what the boundaries are. Um, again, it's not essential, but I just wanted to add that as well. So here's the destination sequence format and um, if we look at the destination sequence and compare it to the uh, original you see that the original is in uh, UHD and the destination is in um, UHD but it's a widescreen format. So the first thing I'm going to do is to take the source and nest that in the destination. And I keep the settings. And so this is how it looks with the widescreen format. So here's the trick. Um, while you're doing your regular editing here, you're scrubbing the timeline and you set your uh, cuts and, and so on, um, you can also, at the same time, check the aspect ratio. So for instance, let's scrub here and we say, um, you know, the, let's say this is, um, we want to see more of the body. We have some extra space here, so we want to push this up. How do we do that? Well, we can say, well, this clip here, we don't, want, we don't know what this clip is. And if we go here, it's somewhere else, but there's a real great uh, shortcut Control shift f on Windows. And if I click that, the current playhead goes to exactly where that scene is. So now I can move this up. And again, these things are helpers here, these bars, so that they, they, they show me how far I can go. And then real time, I can check the change here and say, okay, yeah, that's a lot better. Now we have a little thing here and we're happy with that. 